in is the scroll gallery that goes with the next gen. And as you can see, it adds the um, pictures, and then you can just click on them, and it'll go through, and you can see the bigger picture below when you do that. Um, it did not have a way to have the words show up with it, so I took each picture and put it on a another just a basic black background image that was a little bit longer, and then I added text to it, and that way the text shows up. Uh, these don't they can go to anything, they just turn the pages when you click and go to them. Let me show you the plugin on the other side. Okay, I should have had a wider screen here, it's not showing all the way from the edge. But if you go over on the left and you scroll on down towards the um, bottom, you'll see the gallery, which is the next gen gallery, and below that you'll see the scroll gallery. And if you click on that, it gives you these options and things you can change. Uh, right now, there's only one design in there, the gray photo book. Um, you, you had something custom made for you, maybe something else could be in there. Uh, but this lets you set some things. Uh, this is what I have for the size of the images. Uh, you want to keep them so that they're uh, so that they'll still stay with the shape. You don't want to change the shape of your pictures and warp your things. I mean, it could be. Uh, shrunk or bigger but you want to keep them so they're proportional to each other and keep the same proportion and then you just hit, hit the uh, save changes any times you want to use this you can take any of your galleries that you have in next gen and then there's some code see this is the code over here you can't see it all you see the corner of it but they'll say scroll gallery and you just take that and where it says xxx you put the id number of that gallery in it and you just copy and paste that into your post and it's going to show up right where you put that. Okay, this is the home page and this is uh, what I have here. I just copied that. Um, you can change it. This, these things have some certain codes that can change some of it. You could just put scroll gallery ID equals and then the name of the ID and then you have this little close thing. Um, I went ahead and copied this first before I saw that there's other ways to do this. So this gets what we want. But if you want different galleries on your site to do different things, then you can use this extra code to make it do different things. Uh, but that's just, just cut and paste it in, the gallery's already made, and then you can have the, the little uh, scroll thing like you have on the front page.